Hello there. Hello. I'm Nick, I'm one of the clinical tutors here. Can I just confirm uh, your full name and date of birth, there, please? So, Timothy Bellock, it's the 25th of November, 1960. And how would you like to be addressed normally? Tim. Tim, OK. Um, Tim, I'd like to do a respiratory examination on for you, if that's all right. It's just going to involve me having a look, listen to the feel of your chest, uh, have a listen to your lung fields, and um, also have a look at your hands and your face as well, if that's all right. Yeah, uh, we'll involve you taking your top off, obviously, to do this procedure. Are you happy to do that, or do you want a chaperone? Uh, I don't need a chaperone. Okay, lovely. I'll start the examination. You don't look unduly breathless at the moment? Is that right? Okay. And there's nothing around the bed area to suggest any respiratory disease. Um, can I just have a quick start with your hands, please? Is that nice and warm? One, two, three, four, five. And capillary refill time is coming back in under two seconds. I'm just going to look at your nails for any signs of uh, respiratory disease. Like colonicia, um, which is iron deficiency. And clubbing. Can you just put your fingers together like that? Bring them together. Excellent. There's a diamond shape there, so there's no signs of clubbing at all. Just turn your hands over for me. Not a smoker, Tim? No, can't see any signs of um, tar staining there. I'm just going to have a quick feel of your pulse for a second. pulse is nice and regular in the respiratory rate, it's 12 breaths per minute. I'll uh, do the blood pressure at the end. Just going to have a quick look at your neck if that's all right. You can just relax your head back into the bed. Just look slightly towards the corner and I'm just going to look into your neck for signs of a vein pulsating, which with the light here I can just see. Just confirm that's the JVP. which it is, it starts with a single pulsation, it's filling from above. I'm just going to measure that height from the sternal angle. And that's three centimetres, which is normal. That's lovely. OK, can you just have a look at me, Tim? Can you just pull your eyelids down? Let's have a look at your conjunctiva. No sign of pale conjunctiva, lovely. Can you uh, open your mouth for me? Tongue to the roof of your mouth. And there's no central cyanosis. All right, then just you can relax back again. I'm just going to have a feel of your windpipe. It might be a little bit uncomfortable. And the windpipe is central. OK, do you mind popping your top off uh, for me, Tim? OK, you had any operations at all on your chest? No. no. OK, and there's no sign of any scarring that would fit in with that. OK, I'm just going to have a check what we call expansion. Your chest. I just want you to take a deep breath in and out. And again for me. Okay, my hands moving evenly there. We're just going to do it a bit lower down as well. So in, and fully exhale. Lovely. Nice big breath in and out. And my thumbs are moving apart equally there, so that's fine. I'm just going to have a quick tap on your chest. Okay. So Okay, that's all normal. Just have a quick listen to your chest. I'd say deep breaths in and out through your mouth. Just let me know if you get a little bit breathless, okay?
Okay, that's lovely. You can just sit forward again for me, tell me to do the same on the back. I'm not going to listen to vocal premitus because uh, there's no more vesicular breath sounds there. Okay, can you take a deep breath in and out? And in and out. Lovely, let's do it. Let's lower it down. In and out. And in and out. That's lovely. I'm just going to have a quick tap on your back, okay? I'm just going to have a quick listen to the back of your chest. Deep breaths in and out. Again, there's normal vesicular breath sounds throughout there. I'm just going to check for sacral edema. Okay, that's lovely. You can relax back there, Tim. Uh, I'm just going to check for ankle edema. Up there, and there. I'm just going to, oh, sorry. I'm just going to press. Okay. There doesn't appear to be any edema. OK, then that's the end of the examination. You can get yourself dressed now. Uh, I'm going to discuss my findings with the, uh, my examiner now. Thank you very much. Thank you. Cheers.